Hello YouTubers, beer geeks, and beer hounds alike. Bill here. We're going to do a beer review. We have from Green Flash Brewing Company, Tropical Hazy DNA IPA. This is what the can looks like. This one comes in at 7% ABV and uh, it doesn't have a date on it anywhere on the can but the box it came in did have a date on it and I don't remember what it was but I think it came in at less than a month and a half old so it should be okay um, yeah that's what it looks like all right well let's get it cracked open and see what we got here I picked this up for like 11 bucks out the door at total wine and more so we got seven percenter here uh, I'm not too sure if they're calling this New England or not uh, just says uh, hazy DNA IPA so I don't think they're going for New England or nothing like that all right monster head here monster head all right um well it's gonna be here for a minute so we've got a monster frothy creamy head and a total hazy hazy beer here as you can see totally hazy I can't see any bubbles coming up or anything like that so I'm not sure if there's bubbles or not but you can see how hazy it is Let's get the rest in there I don't see any particulates coming out while I'm pouring it so it's just like uh, hazy as you can see all right well let's get an aroma on this puppy right up front it's like tropical fruits um, mainly um pineapple uh, grapefruit guava mango orange lemon And there, there's even some pininess in there that coming through. Some good pininess notes. The head's turning rocky already, as you can see. But mainly pineapple, grapefruit, and pine, and orange. All right. Well, let's get a hit. Cheers. Okay. The taste follows the aroma well but the aroma is a lot more uh, uh, pungent and stronger than the taste the taste is a little more um, waterier and, uh, less tropically but it is there cheers yeah the aroma there's even maybe some floral notes in there as well um, the taste does follow the aroma it's just not as powerful as the aroma it's like the aroma is real strong and the the sip is just kind of medium strong let's get another hit to see if I can pick up something else got ice cream on top yeah that's pretty good a little bit thin uh, but it is only 7% so can't expect too much for 7% um, Let's do it one more time then we'll wrap it up. It's got a medium to almost light mouthfeel Got a little zestiness to it It seems like the um, the lemon came up a little bit more in the sip than the aroma Cheers.
yeah, that's pretty decent. Um, on a scale of one to five stars, I'll give this puppy a 4.1. And I'll have the description in the description section at the bottom of the video there. And uh, let's do it one more time. We'll wrap it up again. Cheers. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, it does taste tropical, but it's just a little lighter. It's not like super dank or nothing like that. It's just pretty light. A really easy, really easy drinking. I mean, you could session with these really, really good and uh, have a good time. All right, one more time. Cheers. Yeah, that's what we got. 4.1 stars out of 5. Uh, Green Flash makes pretty awesome beers. Um, this is probably not the best hazy I've had. I don't know if they're, this is actually supposed to be like a New England style or not, but it's, it is hazy and it's tropical. It's pretty darn good. 4.1 stars out of 5. And uh, that's my story and I'm sticking with it. Give it. Alright everybody, cheers. Yeah, good. 4.1. All right. Y'all take it easy. I'll catch you later. See ya.